I don't think so. I mean, obviously they're a talented team. They wouldn't uh, have 30 wins, 30 plus wins on the season for uh, no reason. But I mean, uh, we just we gave it our all. We had a couple stops that we should have gotten, I and mean, that might have changed the outcome of the game. But like I said, I'm just real proud of how we performed this year and how we overcame the odds. Do you know what's next for you? Uh, not at this point, no. Just, did you get a chance to talk to the team or address the team after this was over? Yeah, we had uh, brief words just to say, just to tell them, just keep, basically keep going, you know. You got the freshmen and sophomore got a taste. Some of the sophomores that were freshmen last year didn't really get to play that much in this environment, so they got a taste of what it's like and just to come back more hungry. We're not get your crush. So yeah, I really appreciate it. Thank you. Hopefully I'll see you soon. Yeah, I know that when I talked to Andre and Keyshawn and others, and it all talks about how the guys were never really supposed to be here. Mm -hmm. did, did you get that feeling throughout the year that the entire time you were sort of just trying to overcome what everyone else was thinking? Uh, yeah, but we just pretty much made it about ourselves. It was not really about what people say or what they project us because at the end of the day, we control our own destiny. And I think we did a pretty good job of that. Mm -hmm. I ask you doing the same thing, but, but when people look at you and look at your time at Ohio State, what, what do you want to be remembered for? Uh, just probably my ability to lead, got better each year, never stayed the same player, you know, did whatever it took for the team to win, and hopefully that's what I'll be remembered as. What do you, what do you hope that the future of Ohio State basketball looks like with, with all the people in, in this room? Uh, I hope they do better than we did this year, you know, just as that's just what you want to see from your, your family. Yeah, we're really brothers. It's not really cliche. We really mean that. And I hope they, they come back hungry next year and work hard in the offseason and summer and just get better. Um, just from your perspective, when you watch Keyshawn these last few weeks, and he went through struggles at some point during the season, and then he turned it on recently and, and led you guys. What was what was that like watching from your perspective, knowing that it was both both your guys' potential last games at certain times, and, and he led, led you guys through them? Yeah, I mean, everyone on this team knows Keyshawn's a worker. He works one of the hardest working on the team. So when you see the, it finally paying off in these last couple of weeks that we've had, it's very satisfying as a, as a, obviously as a player and then as someone you just care about. You, you want to see everyone do well and have success.